Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded series. We are jumping in for another run. Let's go. Let's build up a new 30 streak. Let's say 30. Tainted Bethany to Mother. Honestly, a pretty fun one. I haven't played Tainted Bethany in quite some time. Of course, she starts off reasonably powerful. So we're just going to pop this off the bat. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> I don't know why, like, the whiz shot is so common for me. Like, this is an item I get all the time. What is it about the whiz shot? And oh my god, is this room bad for whiz shot? Oh lordy lordy. I, I might need to genuinely get rid of whiz shot on purpose before popping Lamageddon again. Because I, I can't do this. You can't keep giving me whiz shot and think you can get away with it, game. Well, now, I will say a few times recently, it's been, it's been okay, like with Andromeda. But like, stop. <laughs> we get it. You like whiz shot. My lord. Okay, simple question for question of the day, but kind of a fun one. What was the last thing you ate and why? Astral projection's pretty decent here. Uh, we got some bombs now for that tinted rock back there. For me, I just ate a packet of beef jerky. It was very, very tasty. And the why is because I'm trying to be slightly healthier at the moment. And so I went to the gym this morning. I had some protein powder after, which honestly is like one of the most filling substances on this planet. Like, I I normally get hungry, because I don't normally have breakfast, but I normally get hungry around like 1 p.m., sometimes earlier. This time, nah. It got to like, it got to like almost four o'clock and I was like mildly peckish. Why do I keep backing myself into corners like this? Yeah, it got to like 4 p.m. and I was like mildly peckish. I'm like, okay, well, that's pretty awesome. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right, what actual item we got here? Um, eh, it's okay. It's okay. It's actually, it's actually better than okay. It's, it's pretty damn good. It's just we need to really keep our range, which in many rooms in Isaac is not plausible at all. Okay, astral projection coming in now. Okay. Getting a little bit worried about our current HP. Um, ooh, that, that, that's decent. Isn't that the more money we have, the more fire rate we get? That's that's pretty decent. I'll take that. But yeah, the mushroom actually does a pretty uh, pretty good job for us when it's firing. But, unfortunately, due to the nature of it, it doesn't fire all that often. Right, I'll definitely pop that down. I'm sorry I would like the keys, but that is not worth my time right now. And we'll try and head back to the shop here. Secret room isn't something on my mind right now. I think shop's this way. I don't think we've seen shop yet. Oh, no, I'm wrong. We have seen shop already. Okay. Okay. So I went to this room for little to no reason. Uh, although I suppose I could have found a tinted rock in here. I didn't, but the fact that I could have. Did, are you serious? Did I get hit there? Why? Oh. Oh, my God. That's amazing. <laughs> okay. Life just got a lot better for us. We're still we're still not in a great spot, but life just got a lot better for us. Okay, no, we hadn't seen the shop yet. I just hadn't been to this room. I thought I'd been to all the other rooms. Okay. So, we have some decent stuff here. I think the first thing we want to do is bomb this. Quickly, just escape from there. Just for the chance that the yeah, soul hearts. Yeah, I gotta say. Don't really care about much else. Do we want compost? Converts pickups into blue flies, doubles your current flies. Uh, but, 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 but. I do quite like compost. Do you know what? Yeah, I, I will gamble on a compost run. Compost is one of those things that I feel a lot of the time it's not very good, but it can stack pretty quickly and get kind of crazy. So I'll, 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 I'll give it a chance. One moment. Let's carry on, let's carry on. Okay, yeah, so we could end up getting something decent out of compost. I don't think it'll be for a while. I think compost is one of those things that you kind of need a, the right room or the right setup for it really to kick off and get going. But once it gets going, it's normally pretty good. It's probably normally pretty set, especially if you get spiders um, and then just keep doubling them and doubling them and doubling them. Especially if we can get ourselves like a AAA battery or um, something that's going to lower the amount of charges. If we can get it to a one room charge, it becomes incredible. On a two room charge, it's pretty good. On a one room charge, it's busted. Absolutely busted. But we'll see what we can do. Uh, ball of bandages, unfortunately, isn't amazing. Oh, uh, oh, uh, actually, actually, it's pr it's pretty busted with Bethany. I didn't even think about that. Okay, so I will take a boss item here 
or try for. We got Tropica Maya. God damn it. Um, anyways, I will go to the alt path. It's a little risky, but do you know what? I got some pennies. It's good for me. Keep it going. Let's keep it going. Okay, let's carry on. Let's carry on. So, obviously, getting, um... Getting baller bandages doesn't make too much of a difference for us, let's be honest. I do like having bigger tiers now though, not because they're useful, because it makes me feel like I have better damage than I do, which is always nice. Lots of stuff there we can't grab, that's a pretty decent avenue for compost maybe, just because we can't gra actually grab any of it, so we might just want to compost it all. I know that there's a, a locked soul heart there, a fettered heart, that I'd very much like to grab, but I kind of don't feel like that's going to happen. Um, right. So let's let's try and get some hearts going first. And try and make compost work a little bit. Because I genuinely think... Oh god, oh god, oh god. I genuinely think we could get compost in a really good spot if we get a few charges for it with the red hearts. I don't like these leeches. They're scaring me. They are scaring me. I always forget these guys move off of their podium straight away as well. It's kind of weird that you can spawn on like a podium like that, if they're just gonna move straight away. All right, let's check out this first. We got a holy poop. I'm gonna go to go for random, and I'm very, very thankful that I did. Now rooms have a chance to have an insta-kill switch in them, which is why I'm looking for one right now. I don't know if it affects the floor that you pick it up on, I'll be honest, because the floor might have already generated. Um, it might not <clears throat> be able to occur on the floor that you pick up the item on, but still, a very good item. Gonna get some insta-kill rooms. I like that. I like that a lot. We'll pop that. Bumble, he's he's a chillin' he's a chillin' little fella. He'll he'll do He'll do just fine. He'll do just fine. But yeah, sadly, we're not getting very many red hearts, and I would very much like some more red hearts so that I can test out this compost theory that I have. But it's not really giving it to us. Because right now with only one, we can't really test out the theory. Uh damn. I went in, do you know, I went in here like, I really want a bomb, but I didn't, I didn't get one. But this, yeah, I was about to say, this might give me one. It did. Okay. Uh, right. I'm going to bomb this. It's going to give me that and that. And that's going to give me the other red heart. Nice. So now, we go over this way. Unfortunately, no flights. So we can't exactly get over here. But we pop that. And then we pop it again, which doubles them again. Okay. Okay, sorry for all the pauses. I do apologize. But yeah, so as you can see, now we have a decent army of spies and flies. Now, this army will be pretty quickly destroyed by the boss. Uh, they're the, 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 the going to disappear pretty quickly. But if any of them survive, it'd be awesome. I don't think many of them will, I'll be honest. But I do think this could be a genuinely very good tactic if we get it going. It's, it's a little hard to get going, I'll admit. Also, we lost another one of our lemma getting flies there. God damn it. Ah! Min Min's always a boss that I just despise. <laughs> I'm just so bad at him. I'm doing, I'm doing okay so far, but just generally, I always feel so panicked. Just because of that attack there. I know the fly, when he throws the fly at you, it doesn't deal contact damage, but it's just, it's so close to you, it just doesn't make me feel safe at all. Like that bit there, just, he throws it at you and it fires, and it's, I always just feel like it's going to easily hit me. But like I said, at least they don't do contact damage. That would be awful if they did. Dude, do you like one HP? Just die. Just die. Thank you. <laughs> we got the stapler. Unfortunately, obviously, devil deals are completely out of reach for us right now. So let's just go to the next floor. But now we should start seeing our uh, do not touch buttons appear, which should... They, they, they honestly are pretty common. Like, they're not... I, I'd say you get one in every, like, four rooms or so. Maybe even a little more often than that sometimes. It depends. Unfortunately, we didn't get any extra soul hearts in that last area either um, from from picking up pennies. This is a room that I might get hit on. Um, we'll see. It's the way these spiders. Yeah, they just spread out too much. It's just, just no. Just, just stop it, spiders. Nobody liked that. Okay, so health is pretty low. There's something great. Look at that. It's beautiful. It's genuinely beautiful. And there's some soul hearts. Beautiful, beautiful. 
Right, so, I'm going to hold on to my red hearts. There's another one of these here. Ah, that did get me hit, but worthwhile, nonetheless. Pinball. Oh, nice. Pinball's pretty decent for us here. Kamikaze, however, is not. So we'll take this. Hey, Willow, right back at you with these flies. Right back at you. I've got some too. Look at that. I've got some too. Do you want to face me now? So, yeah, I gotta say, essentially the first thing I do every room is go and search for that. <laughs> go and search for the button, because a lot of rooms have them. A lot of rooms have them. And they are very, very useful. So I'm gonna try and do that whenever I can. I'm just currently looking for a good room to kickstart compost. Also, the compost resprite is just incredible. Just, just to, just to note, just to add on to this. This is another room that I'm just checking to see. There isn't any, uh, unfortunately, but there is something that could give us some nice soul hearts. If it actually gives us money, it might end up giving us a counterfeit penny. I kind of feel like it will, just because it'd be typical of it to do so. This room's unfortunately a little bit laggy, but we're doing okay. God damn, this is a long room. A lot going on in here. Our Willow Wisps are doing a good job of killing stuff. I really like the Willow Wisps. They're really cool. Right, so we'll see if this actually gives us any money. It did. I realize it would be good to maybe compost these to kickstart our compost. But I actually think it's better that we pick it up to try and get Soul Hearts. Unfortunately, we didn't get any, but I still think it was worth it. And also, just having the money itself is pretty good for um, our shop here. Nun's Habit, you say? I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe not. Yeah, no. Nun's Habit's like, it's got some potential, but we're not getting hit that much. Keeper's Sack, however. Keeper's Sack is very good. Um, yeah. Okay, this is good. This is very good. I like what just happened there. I like what just happened quite a bit. <laughs> we got a rune in here of some description. We got... Another insta-kill room, lovely. We even got a tinted rock as well. Which is going to lead us to some more money, which is going to give us another half soul heart. This train just keeps it rolling, and it's rolling in the right direction. I like it. I don't know what health I'm on right now, but I feel like it's decent, whatever it is. Okay. Although it's money, I think this is our kickstart, where we go boom and boom. And that's going to give us quite a lot of flies and spiders. Which, again, will probably all die to the boss. But it means a pretty quick kill on the boss. We also got safety pin here as well, which is whatever. Yeah, I think, I, think it's, I think it's good to just have a lot of flies and spiders for the boss. Whether we use them uh, later in the floor or not. We got clog here. I will try and keep them alive, but obviously they're kind of at the whim of the game now. Yeah, you see, almost all of them have gone. I really like the way the Willows are, like, surrounding this guy right now. They're, like, perfectly around him. It's just really entertaining, like, visually. <laughs> By the way, I have been playing the Le the LEGO Star Wars game, the new one, the uh, Skywalker Saga. That game is just unbelievably fantastic. <laughs> I'm having such a blast. I used to play the uh, old LEGO Star Wars games when I was younger, and goddamn, it's holding up. Uh, Battle Royale. Unfortunately... Not really something we want. We will go and do our mirror room now because we're meant to be going mother right. Yes, we are. Yeah. Absolutely loving them for anyone that is wondering. God damn, they're really, really good games. We can also get that rune. The Underscript rune. What are you? What do you hold for me? Anzus. Okay. I will, uh... I will keep an Anzus. I've got to be very careful here, because I don't want to accidentally blow up the mirror. Damn it. No more soul hearts. Yeah, if you blow up the mirror while you're in the mirror dimension, you just die. <laughs> good, good. I think I'm just going to pop that now. we actually got kind of far to go to get to our item room here. Oh, we got this room too? Are you kidding me? I mean, with flight, it shouldn't be too bad, but still, I do not like. Killing enemies is a chance of giving you a ghost. Ooh, that would be really good if we could carry it, but the, tr the trinket we have right now is too important. 
Oh god, that was not how I wanted this to go. Scary room. <laughs> Very scary room. Button there again. It seems that the buttons aren't mirrored. Like, they don't respect the rules of the mirror dimension. Which is somewhat to be expected, but still. Um, What boss was it again? I don't remember. Oh, it was Clog. Uh, I feel like I could do Clog. But... I kind of need something before we do. I'm going to give it a go. I'm going to give Clog a go, but I need something first. Oh, wait. Damn it. I was like, the ca I was like, I'm going to get the card. The card's stuck over there now. It's too much of a hassle. I'm past it. <laughs> I'm past it. Right, let's just go. I realize I could probably go into my cash room as well, but you know me. Do I ever play optimally? No. Does it cause me death sometimes? Hell yes. Do I have two bombs? No. <laughs> Damn it. I'm pretty sure there's one in the shop, though. Pretty sure. Oh, wait. There's one right there. I should have just... Wait, no. I can't even get that one. Doesn't matter. I mean, it is. I can, I can use... I can use the white fire to get that one. Okay. That's, that's going to be my order of operations here. Just use the white fire. Go to my cash room now. Get myself a black heart. There's some bombs. Leave here. And you know what? We're back as normal Bethany because that was a combat room. We'll chuck that in there for a lost soul, maybe. Oh, a lost soul at the end of the floor as well. Hell yes. Perfect time to get a lost soul. Unless there's enemies in here that somehow kill him. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. Let me take him down. I missed out on a soul heart there because I'm an idiot. But let's see what he gives us. Do you know what? An immortal... Yeah, pretty good Pretty good going there, fella. Pretty good going. If we can keep him alive for a whole last floor, I'll be impressed, but we'll try it. Ooh, God. Uh, no. No. This room, no. No. Where's Lost Soul gone? Poor Lost Soul. He was so young. He did nothing wrong. Imagine if it duplicates my leeches. Ah, oh, it doesn't. That'd be so good. By the way, synergy idea right there for Prian. Get on that. Let, let you be able to compost the leeches. Interesting room. I like it. Takes a little bit of getting used to, but I like it. Easy. <laughs> Bobby bombs. Oh, eight inch nails is fantastic for us here. All the missed out on a great item. But eight inch nails, eight inch nails is still really good. Holy hell, we are getting very lucky right now. We also got a soul heart there. And it, our, our immaculate heart is going to heal right soon, I think. Yeah, there you go. Immaculate heart healed. Immaculate hearts are really good too. <laughs> We've got a very strong setup going on right now. I didn't even know you could have more than one Immaculate Heart at one time. You learn something new every day. Ooh, damage up and get rid of that blindness. Nice. Everything's looking nice and fresh. And another one. It's beautiful. That's very good. <laughs> that is very, very good. Let's just bomb this this time. And we've got enough bosses left for that to be valuable, right? Awesome. Yeah, jumper cables is going to be very, very good with both Lemmageddon and uh, Compost, so 100% taking those. I was kind of re-rolling to try and get, like, a 9 volt, but oh well. I don't really care if I lose many of my Wisps. I don't think there's any of them that I'm super precious about. Do you know, whoever made a wave of this, vanilla or modded with stonies in them, there's a special place deep down for you. This is horrible. <laughs> you know what you did, you evil, evil person. 
it is an interesting idea. I do I do like it, but I also hate it. <laughs> it's a good idea, like, gameplay-wise. It's not a good idea, gameplay-wise. <laughs> I don't know why my knife piece is just kind of chilling over there. He seems to be uh, a little lost. Scorpio. Hell yeah. Give me a bit of that Scorpio nice. Oh, dude. Get out the way, you stupid shits. <laughs> You're shysters. I can't shoot anything. You're in the way. Okay. Last wave. There's a bunch of gyros. Okay. Not terrible. We'll take the HP up plus damage. And I'll be on my way, thank you. Uh, I don't think there's really much else we want to do on this floor, is there? I think we just go... Not seeing too many of the champion um, repentance bosses, but at the same time, it's good that they're not super common. I was just about to say, can I get any of these enemies to blow up this rock, but none of these enemies blow up. That one kind of does, but not, not really. Ow. It's okay though, as long as we don't lose another half heart, we get rehealed. Lovely. Uh, bah, 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 bah. I'm looking for a kick, a jumping off point for compost because we have so many charges now. Um, yeah, why not? Yeah, two tinted rocks there. If we get some bombs, that'll be nice. There's another tinted rock in here as well. Lots of tinted rocks right now. Lots of tinted rocks. Leo. Well, that just about does it, doesn't it? Needed all the bombs. Now we just walk over everything we need. Okay, we got a zealot heart as well, which I'm pretty happy about. The zealot heart can be pretty good for us. We get a lemmageddon wisp if we manage to keep it to the next floor. I don't know how it functions with an immortal heart, but we'll find out, I guess. Go, my willows. Oh, the heat missing. Okay. Hop in here real quick. Ooh, this could be our jumping off point. We don't need the soul heart money, so... The, the, the soul hearts from the money, sorry. So, yeah, okay. So now we go... There you go. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. So now, as long as we don't... Really, this room again? As long as we don't lose... Ev this room's bullshit. This room is bullshit. As long as we don't lose every single fly and spider in a room, in uh, over the course of two rooms, should I say, members card, that's decent, we uh, we actually basically get them all back. It's pretty incredible. I'm going to check this out, just because you, you can get some really cheap stuff in here, uh, such as this. I might as well buy this. It's a purchase because keep a sack, and also it's actually just very, very good for us. So yeah, now we pop that, and then we get all of our flies and spiders back again. There is a limit to how many you can have, but still. Forget me now. I'm sorry, but... No. Just no. Right, we need to go and do our mines thingy, don't we? We do have a bit of a uh, speed problem, but otherwise we're looking fine. Really? You're on top of that? Okay, there you go. And then we pop it again. And this is what I mean. What, like, you basically get to a critical mass where spiders everywhere. Just so many spiders. It's unbelievable. And because we also have jumper cables, the likelihood of us keeping this chain going is even higher. Like, bosses can be a problem for this because obviously if you don't have a ton of damage, they're just going to all get eaten up by the boss. But I think we have enough damage to support it, I'll be honest. And as you can see, we have an absolute army right now. Oh, wait. Question. Damn it. We still have the Leo Wisp. I was wondering if we still had the Leo effect. Because that would genuinely be incredibly powerful in this area. If we could just walk over all the rocks. That would save us so much time. 
But unfortunately, we have to deal with the slightly laggy way of doing this, which is fine, but annoying. I've been debating whether to get that mod that allows us to skip this for a while now. I still haven't done it. I probably should just pull the trigger and do it. Because at this point, it just kind of makes sense. So I don't think any of our spiders will end up getting eaten up by Mother here. Okay, good, good. Okay, and that wasn't too bad at all. That wasn't too bad at all. The one thing about this is it slows down your fire rate to a crawl. Good, good. We just need the key. Using these key boxes is a bit risky too, because, yep, yeah, that's exactly why. It takes a second to use them, but if you take a look, our immortal heart is still activated. So as long as we don't get hit again, it's going to uh, re-up and we'll be able to have a full immortal heart again. Little bit of a spicy section here. I don't know why the overlays in this area cause just such redonkulous lag, but they, they really do. Okay, last little segment here. And then last room. Which is pretty much a straight shot down. Good, good. Easy going. And once we complete another room, we'll get our uh, Immortal Heart healed up. But, I think we're good to leave this floor now. We've got our full knife created. Oh, wait, I think we will lose our uh, Immortal Heart to the Mausoleum door, right? Dogtooth, nice. Actually, do you know what? We should try and utilize Dogtooth here. Either up or down. Pretty good stuff, thank you. Uh, right. Oh, we haven't actually done the boss yet. Easy. Probably shouldn't have wasted that on him, but there you go. We got sad bombs, nice. And I think fire rate is better for us right now, because we're pretty low on fire rate. Yeah, so unfortunately the immortal heart is gone. Wait, what? It made me take another heart. But we've got hearts back over this way, so we'll, we'll just go grab those real quick. Yeah, unfortunately, my order operations and picking up hearts and stuff hasn't been great so far, but it's whatever. Also, we'll use Dogtooth here to just see if we can find the secret room. So it's probably in here. Wait a minute. Yeah. I'd guess here, but it didn't bark in the other room, so maybe it's here? That'd be weird. But it is. And we also got mini mush as well. Nice. And then from here, we can get into the boss trap room. A bunch more soul hearts. Nice. Flat damage up. Hell yes. As you just saw, we had an unfortunate predicament there. Where quite literally every single spider we earned and loved got destroyed. So we now need to rebuild... We now need to rebuild with compost because, unfortunately, Bombino just spawned in the worst place possible for our spiders there. Or at least our spiders were in the worst place possible for when he spawned is more so the point. But we should, we should have this in the bag. He got hit, but I don't really care. Nice. Yeah, so unfortunately we are going to have to rebuild, which is a bit of a shame. But, not not terribly so. We also have another soul heart here, so we might as well dip in here and see what's what. Okay. Hey, look at that. Beautiful. Luck penny and a lot of money. Yeah, we can just grab that now. And I think we're sitting pretty. We're in a good spot. I actually maybe... Should I... Should I forget me now? Do you know what? I'm going to. I Compost, you've been fun. I like you. You've been a good chap. But... I feel like... We can get quite a lot of a forget me now here. You see that pro move right there. Cool. 
cool, cool. I'm going to pop all three of these. Tears up. Paralysis. And Estrogen up. Might as well pop that now. Euthanasia. Actually got an item pool item there. Nice. Euthanasia plus 8 inch nails is kind of a funny combo as well. I haven't seen that many of the kill switches in a little while here. Tonsil, no thank you. But yeah, we're kind of looking for a spacebar item now to, to, to replace compost. But yeah, I, I didn't really mind losing compost. It's good. It's just, it's quite a lot of maintenance. And um, it can be easily ripped away from you, as you saw, by a, by a boss. But it is, it, is, it is a fun style of play. I think that compost quite often gets overlooked. Brittle burns. Hmm. I will come back to that one depending on how many soul hearts I get this floor. Dude, this room needs to actually go away. Why is it so common? It's horrible. Um. Apparently we have secret room in here. Humble bundle, nice. Is it here? No. Um, I think we go for some rerolls here and try and get something better. I think stopwatch is pretty good. <laughs> and I'll just bomb this to see if we can get a soul heart. Unfortunately not. We got whatever card that is. Never seen that before. I do not know. Beautiful. Oh, we got a patched heart there. Nice. Not had one of them yet. Patched hearts allow you to heal broken hearts. They're pretty powerful, but they're funny. I like them. Humbling bundle should allow us to get slightly more soul hearts. Okay, so it's we know it's here now. Okay, don't really care about them. We know we know what we want. The theater, shocking buddy. I didn't realize it was a. Oh, wait, it's that dude. I don't think it said theater. Now that I'm thinking about it, I don't think it said theater. Right. I don't think I want Brittle Burns at this point. I think instead, I'm just going to play it safe and take the other item, which will be terrible, guaranteed. Oh, it's, Euphor it's Euphoria. Euphoria is not bad. I'm holding Euphoria just at the ready right now. Oh, one mistake I did make on that last floor is I really shouldn't have even bothered filling out the mausoleum door. Because it just made no difference. <laughs> I basically spent my hearts on it for no reason. Which is a bit stupid, but eh. Whatever. I don't think this guy can Brimstone early on in the fight. I think it can only happen once he gets like below half HP. I don't actually know that for sure, but it always feels that way. But he's dead anyways. We got him good. And we'll pop that. We got the screw. Nice. We've got devil deals here, which I'm not really looking for, but I will check. Um, I think you're a pretty good pickup. Otherwise, I'm not really super convinced. I realize, again, before this, going down here, it's a little risky. But hey, her. I'm in it for the risk. I like, I like playing like this. Playing like this is more enjoyable. Of course, I could lose, but I'm on a one streak right now. I'm not exactly trying to savor the streak. Once I get, like, past ten, I start taking it a little more seriously. But for the most part, I don't take it very seriously. I think we can still win this run anyways. Jesus Juice, nice. Hanged Man. I'll go for the World Card here. Good to know we're going the wrong way. Yeah, Incubus is a huge DPS upgrade anyways. Like, literally a 75% DPS upgrade if we hit our shots. Not quite 100 anymore, but still very good. Check this out. I mean, that is technically a spacebar item. I did ask for that, so there you go. <laughs> Not really one, the one that I'd care for. But then again, with sad bombs, actually not terrible, really. it's It spawned it on an island. I don't know if that's one that naturally occurs in the room, to be honest. It could be.
I'm glad I remembered I had a <laughs> remote detonator, then I would have been sat there a while. Come on, soul hearts, soul hearts, soul hearts. Yeah, yeah. Got a few. We got a few. Sad onion, more fire. Fire rate's in a really good spot now. Good, good. Deck of cards is definitely better. Oh, I hit myself on the spikes there. Did not mean to do that. Okay. Hive mind is... Is hive mind good? For us, really? It's good enough. It's good enough. Soul heart's good too. Plus one charge for your active when you use a card or pill. Seems like a no-brainer considering our active generates cards. We literally get money back. Your money back guaranteed. Would be nice to try and get the uh, battery baby as well there. We'll see if we can get that. I'm gonna play out a few more of these rooms here. Death card. Spider baby. Okay, this little buddy, this little zappy fella, doing a good job. A mighty fine job indeed. I'm just popping them all. Giving us his extra charges, why not? <laughs> Take the high priestess to the boss fight. Oh, we can't afford it now as well, let's go. I just realized. Gimme you. Join the crew. And away we go. God, them faces scare me. <laughs> They're still evil looking. Oh, right. A lot of our familiars are following this dude for some reason. Not quite sure why that is. Okay, that was that was a good hit. And do we need speed or plus? I think plus HP and a, a pill effect is good. I found, I found pills. There you go. Flatstone is fine. The devils, whatever. The devil. Stars for the next floor. This is coming together quite nicely. I like where this run is going. Kind of a weird one. Kind of a weird one, but it's got a lot of moving parts. Oh, Mum's Razor. Hell yes. Give me that bad boy. Mum's Razor is genuinely fantastic now. It's pretty hard for me to use it. I don't really know why I picked it up, I'll be honest. But honestly, it was that or Shrink Ray, and the Shrink Ray didn't really appeal to me. Even though I didn't know the Shrink Ray was what the other item was. I'm still going to use that as my excuse. Lovers. Oh. Oh. Samson's Chain and Lead Pencil. Samson's Chain I'm not a big fan of, but Lead Pencil, though. I can get behind a Lead Pencil. Lead pencil can destroy. Look at this. With the amount of speed we have as well. We can like get in. Oh my lord. We can get in and uh, easily take care of those red buttons the moment the room starts if we see them. I love that. Nice. Juked those guys out nicely. Can't believe how hard this trinkets ended up carrying us throughout this run. Love it. Proptosis, hell yes. Love a bit of Proptosis, me. Birthright. Spawn four random item wisps. Ooh, that's a really cool effect. I never knew that's what the effect was for her, uh, her thingy, but I'm, I'm, I'm happy. I will try and grab that if I can. I've also got half a soul heart here too. We've also got a secret room off of here somewhere. I guess we can check a few different places. Picked all the wrong ones. Wait, what? Excuse me? I am very confused. There is a secret room off of one of these walls, but it won't tell me which one. Is it here? I am so confused. Where the hell is it? 
I don't know. It's lying. It's just lying, isn't it? Crawl space. Nice. We got a reverse hermit card at some point. I don't really know where we got that from, but I'll take it. Look down. No, thank you. I ain't your alabaster. I ain't your alabaster. Uh, I am tempted by alabaster box. Now, what does the reverse hermit do? Did I just completely fumble that? I think I did. I thought I did something else. Not as many soul hearts as I was hoping for here. Trying to play out this guy. I don't want to spend too much on him though. I only want to go down to 15. Okay, sorry dude, you've uh, ended yourself here. I was like, maybe I could make the alabaster box work. That's, that's essentially what I was trying here. I don't think I can. <laughs> Looking at it now, I don't think I can. Okay. Back to it. So, I wonder what four quality items we'll end up getting. Oh, wait. is this, Am I dumb? The secret room's here. Emperor Lovers is very good. Booster pack. Oh, Queen of Hearts. Pretty good. It's quite a lot of hearts. <laughs> That's quite a lot of hearts. Nice. Okay, we got some decent stuff there. Um, I guess I'll just go like Secret Room. Come into the secret room and then just go. See what we got. I don't even know. There's chaos in there, PhD. There's some other stuff in there. I don't know. There's a lot of stuff in there. We're, we're kind of, it's kind of a guessing game at this point. What the hell is that? Who are you? Is this like a resprite of that Andromeda item? Is it gonna like. Yeah, it is! Oh, that's so cool. Okay, I like that. Empress. Tower. Okay, let's go do our boss now. This has been quite, quite the floor, hasn't it? Quite the floor. I don't know if what I did was a good decision. But I did it. I feel like I'm probably going to lose a lot of these wisps pretty quickly, but... Oh well. Nah, we got chaos, so uh, all of our items are all messed up now. Oh shit, our knife is like nowhere near us. Okay, we got it, we got it. That was a little tough. Booster pack. The Fool, Wheel of Fortune, turn all of your heart contenders to burn hearts filled with rotten hearts. I don't think that would work for us, right? Crackling Slag, look at this hot shot. Wow, that's some quite hot shots. Those hot shots are rather large too. Wow, this, this run's really gone off the rails. This, this really, really got out of hand quite quickly. What one flaw can do to a man. <laughs> Ooh, also we got loads of extra secret rooms. I like that. Solar Bethany. I like it. Yeah, I don't even know how to control what is going what is going to be going on right now. I don't know what to suggest.
Yeah, there's a whole hell of a lot. I'm just going to full card just to go back here to get the extra charge. I'm loving this little combination. The world. The world again for some reason. I don't know why. Pop that real quick. I love that resprite of that. Rather than it just being a fireball, it's now like an actual like familiar. I love that. It's so cool. Dark Bum is here now. Hanged Man is whatever. Get some extra fire rate up from this. Another bit of fire rate there. And a little bit more fire rate from this. We've got 11 keys, so I should say we'll use that. We've got sharp plug from it immediately, so there you go. Right, I think Mother's in for a bit of a bit of a hard time, wouldn't you say? I think she's in for a bit of a hard time. Sacrificial dagger. Ace of spades. Ace of spades. Yeah, have a have a good time trying to capture me. And hello, sir. I think you're going down pretty quick too. Fiery fireballs of rage. Go. Good. Yeah, I don't even know like half the items that are interacting with this build. That's how wacky it is. Golden flakes. I think so. All golden hearts. Oh my god. Beautiful. And this is like now a 33% chance, right? It says 17 still, but I think 17 is still doubled. Anyways, to the next floor. Quite crazy. I'm checking secret rooms just in case we get any items. And there you go. That right there is an item. We also got another item in there at some point, I think. I don't know. Right, keep going. Push ever forward. Rooms like this are the worst ones for us. We've got no control over when the enemies pop up. Luckily, they all popped up in a nice, even order. Evil Charm is on the way. Dude, stop stealing my red hearts, please. It's not okay. Oh, you're still alive. I did not see you there. Yeah, I might have gone to a dead end here, but I can use the secret room to escape. We got the macro key. All my keys are space for items when they're fully charged. Does not work on items with no charge. That sounds like a really good th thing for us. I'm taking it. Also, we got a reverse strength here, which I think is going to be pretty nice. Okay. I think we should go straight for the boss here. This has been nuts. Let's go. Strength card. Use it. And then, yeah, if we kill any, like, creatures or anything, it's going to give us uh, charges and they're going to automatically get used. If for some reason red hearts drop, which I don't even know how that'd be possible, but they could. There you go. Automatically used. Do you see that? I like that macro key as a trinket. It's a really good idea. It's pretty simple, pretty basic. But in a lot of circumstances, it could help you a lot. Like a guppy's head sort of circumstance. Sometimes you just forget to use it. Obviously, other scenarios, it's going to be bad. You don't want it on like a D6 or anything like that. I don't know why the fire sprites are so ridiculously massive. But I respect them. Also, another thing. Just the sheer amount of Lemmigate and Wisp we have are just going to protect us from all damage. There's essentially no way anything touches us. You can fire all you've got at us, but it ain't going to touch me. You are also sort of right on top of the Flare Boy there. Boom. Easy. I hope you guys did enjoy this one. Absolutely fantastic run. Ended it on a bang. And this is why I play Risky, because sometimes this sort of shit happens. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.